playing around with y'all and like showing y'all my hair and stuff. I am just like, yeah, I'm loving my hair. Okay. And some of you guys must be like, oh my God, I hear grow back so quickly. Yeah, but it's like stretched to the max right now, <laughs> okay? But yeah, uh, if you were with me a couple months ago and I did cut my hair when I was stretching it, it wasn't looking this luxurious and luscious. So yes, my hair is back, yo. Okay, anyways, down to business. All right, so I am here to bring you guys my favorites of 2012. And I intend to do my favorite line from like the shampoo, conditioner, the uh, moisturizer, and the line has a oil. And then I'm going to come to you guys and I'm going to show you guys my favorite conditioners. Now they're from different lines, but just my favorite conditioners for 2012 my favorite leave-ins, my favorite um, deep conditioner, and y'all know how much I like Old John, but I got some other ones, okay, because y'all know Old John expensive. Okay, and I am going to have a category, did I say leave-in? Maybe not leave-in, um, I'll see how much I have to come and bring it to you guys, and if you guys follow me for a while, um, you know I've, I have tried several leave-ins, and my favorite oils and i'll show you guys my blow dryer i'll show you guys all my like my steamer because some people wanted to see the steamer that i had which you know if i told you that's okay my favorite like tools and so on okay um all right so my favorite line i have been sitting on for a very very long time because i purchased it like uh few months ago and I was sleeping on it then I tried it and I was like so excited when I tried it but I couldn't come on and say anything because I was saying to myself you know what like y'all want me to like try it and try it and try it and try it and try it before I come on and tell you guys and I'm the type of person because I'm very experimental with my hair I know when I try something like two times three times like okay like this is good for me okay i could try some one time like the camille rose almond jai when i tried that like last april and i came on and i was like y'all this product is the best i was like it's the best new product on the on the market that's what i had said and you know a few months later like you see all these reviews and stuff and people loving it like you know when you try something when it really works in your hair so the philosophy of you know, you gotta try it for like one year before you come on and review it. I don't subscribe to that, but you just gotta be careful with your reviews. That's that's all I gotta say. And some you guys are so skeptical too. When I started YouTube, it was just like sharing, you know? I learned a lot from YouTube, so I came on to kind of share because my hair was tore up from the floor, <laughs> okay? And it wasn't on the floor. <laughs> But, um, you know, it was just like a sharing atmosphere. And now it's just like there's so much skepticism and so much like, you know, when you do a review and you read the comment section when, you know, and, and I understand, you know, you guys have a reason to feel that way, but you can't think that every vlogger is that way. And so when, when I know my, I, it's a love of sharing, you know, that I'm here on YouTube. It's the only reason why I'm here on YouTube. I mean, there's no other reason. I mean, I'm not getting paid and I buy my own junk, okay? So, anyways, I say that to say, my favorite line of 2012 that I spent with my own money, and I did uh, buy it an event, and I did interview the person who was representing the line, and I took it down, because it was just shaking and doing all that stuff. But when I tried this, I had to call my mom because I could not come on YouTube and tell you guys. So I called my mom and said, Mom, I love this product. Okay, it is, and you might have heard me mention it before, the Urban Bella Chic Signature Series. And I got the Nun Lather Cleanser. Let me tell you about this cleanser. Okay? Now, y'all know I got dry scalp. And sometimes I come on here and you might see like a little flake and stuff like that on my hair. It's just, it's been diagnosed. I've been diagnosed with dry scalp from as a teenager. I just, it just, I could wash my hair the next day 
it's flaking up, <laughs> okay? So I have to use certain things on my scalp to prevent that. But you see this here shampoo? First of all, I was under the impression when I just started my journey that I was looking for a shampoo that lathered up because in your perm days, that's what you're looking for, something that lathered up and you think that it's cleansing your hair. So happens that with natural hair, that's not the case. So when I had gotten this, because the you know all the information I was gathering, I was like, I gotta buy this line. This thing feels so good on my scalp. It's like mentally, I mean, it feel like it was working in my scalp. Plus, the actual like consistency is really, really thick, and I can't. I don't want to pour it out and show you up. But the consistency for this is so thick and when you're working it in, it feels like it's a conditioner, okay? So I was like, oh my gosh, like, wow, this feels so good. My hair was not up. I was like, hmm. Okay, I did a couple wash and then I tried the conditioner. This conditioner <laughs> has the menthol feeling on your scalp too. And I was just like, what the heck, you know? So literally like when I tell you I really really like this sign I went online at when I had first tried it because I had bought it at the event just to look to see if I had gotten a discounted price um, because I think I had paid like 50 something dollars for the shampoo conditioner and I had uh, done I had gotten the um, stretch and twist cream now this cream is okay um, I have a lot of creams, as you guys know. I have a lot of stylers, so I'm not gonna say this was the best styler, but it was a good styler and it complemented everything else. And the smell, smell it smells like some like some ice cream that I really really love. It smells like ice cream, but it's what kind of ice cream? I can't remember the. The flavor of the ice cream but it's one of my favorite ice cream and I can't remember it right now y'all know I'm not good with scents but it smells good okay <laughs> it smells really really good so um, and of course I don't really wear my hair like defined so I can't tell you that oh it defined my curls I just know that my hair was really really soft when I tr when I try this entire line my hair was soft, okay? So the oil also is the hair shine butter. Like I said, I've tried several, I have several um, oils here. And um, again, I'm not gonna say it's the best thing I've ever tried, but like just all together, it was a really, really good oil. It did give me sheen. It didn't, I mean, that's just my hair was just overall was just like from top to bottom, the best line. Because you know how when you try a line and you might just have one spectacular thing in the line. Like here I had two spectacular things and then two good things and they didn't offset each other. Because sometimes, you know, like you try that line and you're like, oh my gosh, like you tried, the shampoo wasn't too hot and then the conditioner was really, really good and then everything else was at. like this. Like I really, really like this line and I believe that I found one of the three stylers, not stylers, one of the three product lines that I was looking for in 2012, because that was my mission. I became a product junkie in search for, um, you know, three lines. And I've tried several, several lines, and this is my favorite line of 2012. If you actually check on the website, um, and I'll put the website below, if you want to check it. Like I said, I'm not affiliated with them or anything. Um, I think the the shampoo was like $17 and it said fan favorite. When I looked, it said fan favorite. I'm like, it wasn't just me, <laughs> okay? I loved the shampoo. And it's just weird because it barely gave you any suds. Like I was looking for suds. Now the other shampoo that I really, really like had so much more suds, so much more suds than this one. But just like all together, I can't tell y'all. Like, I am just so happy right now for myself. I'm not even happy to share it to y'all. I'm just happy for myself, <laughs> okay? Because I feel like I'm good now. Like, I don't even need to have like three favorite shampoos. I think I'm just gonna finish it too. Like, I'm not gonna try any of the shampoos. I'm just like, I'm tired of just like trying shampoos and it jacking up my hair and I have to come out the shower and detangle. <laughs>